Franklin said T star Michael Landon's cancer treatment started Sunday. The goal is to eradicate tumor. Uh, his treatment will combine five fluorouracil uh, chemotherapeutic agent uh, with uh, what I now term the 10 point plan, which we have proposed uh, in 1983 with our book. Uh, that will have nutritional adjunctive measures uh, with certain vitamins and minerals, a low fat, high fiber diet. Uh, he has stopped smoking already. Uh, there won't be any alcohol. On April 5th, Landon, 54, learned he had pancreatic cancer that had already spread to his liver. Surgery is the only proven cure, but Landon's tumor was inoperable. Without surgery, pancreatic cancer is 99% fatal, usually within six months. But if you're going to try to go on, if you're going to try to beat something, uh, you're not going to do it standing in the corner. Nancy Reagan was one of several friends who told Landon about Simone's cancer program. Simone was part of the team of doctors who treated President Reagan's colon cancer. The goal of Simone's program is to get the patient's whole body to fight the cancer. He's pleased about that he's in a uh, plan uh, that he can do a lot for himself. And I think that's what a lot of cancer patients need and want. He's very upbeat, very strong, uh, very energetic, and he's going to fight uh, and fight well. Landon is back in Los Angeles. A home treatment service will give him chemotherapy once a week and do the necessary blood tests under Simone's supervision. Landon plans to continue working, although not on his planned series, and he wants to write a book. He is surrounded by good family. Uh, you know, he has always been portrayed as a very family-oriented person, and he is that. With the patient on the West Coast and the doctor on the East Coast, Michael Landon's cancer treatment will involve a lot of phone calls and a lot of plane trips. In Lawrenceville, New Jersey, Dr. Joanna Shaw, Fox News, Channel 5.